What is... Hold up. No. No. What is that? What is that? Is that the... Alright. Is that the ghost leviathan? And, uh, welcome back to Subnautica, guys. And, uh, I found a new egg. And... Well, there's two options. This is either a ray of some kind or it's one of those uh brain crabs that we found the other day um also we just got this coming in listen to the radio this is here life pod seven coordinates attached pod is structurally sound but the fabricators bust requesting assistance seven out okay so we got another life pod approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank where the heck is this? Aurora Star- Oh, hell no. Nah. Or, maybe. Because today, you may notice something. We have everything here to create the Cyclops. And, well, we're going to do it right now. So, I got everything ready yesterday when I was off camera. So... Luckily, I basically had everything. I had to go out and mostly get uh, the enameled glass stuff, so the stalker teeth there. And then it was the titanium. I had to go out and get some scrap. All this stuff I apparently had on hand. So, or, well, I did. Lead, uh, lubricant, and uh, advanced wire. Well, advanced wiring, I kind of had to go get silver. But yeah, I mostly had everything. Oh, uh, yeah. Only experienced Helms people should attempt to pilot this vehicle solo. So this is originally supposed to be piloted by three people. And I'm about to pilot it by myself. Okay. Um. Here. Oh. It wants us to board. Oh. We have a... The reef back Leviathan right there. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Oh, this is so awesome. So, oh, it comes with storage already? Can I name the storages? No, but you know what? That's actually a decent amount of storage. Then, what's back in here? Oh, this is the docking bay for the Seamoth. And then, launch bay, of course. Close that all up. And then this is the below the engine part, I believe. We want to go back down this way. And this should be the helm. Oh, I got lights on and off. And then... I don't know if that's my headlights. Oh, and then we can change the color too. Nice. We'll do that here at some point. Um, this is, I guess, our indicator of the ship. What's going on? Uh, then we got another section back here. And then, of course, we got this. We can dock the Seamoth to this. And then, uh, again, we have the battery. Batteries? Okay. So these are the power cells. Um, this is the upgrade fabricator? Yeah, so Cyclops depth module. I might be able to make one of those. Uh, I'm just looking at this stuff here. I might be able to get an efficiency module as well. Uh, shield generator template. Decoy tube upgrade. I mean... This is the one I only care about, is the depth module. I don't know actually what this one's depth is, but I'm pretty sure this is like, what is it? Six power cells? So, oh, oh we, okay. I thought this might have uh, the same amount of upgrades as, as the Seamoth. I guess, no, we get six. But we can also build on this, in this one. So, I need titanium, gold, and a coral sample. Because we need to make a fabricator. So, what we'll do here. Um, power up the power engines. Up. Oh, so we actually have to power this thing up? Oh, there's an external camera system? 
Oh, this actually helps me a lot. So what that means... If I can just turn in place here. And we'll go forward. Turn in place again. And begin to descend. I definitely hit something. That should be good. Now we can go get what we need. Let's see how close we actually got to the base. Oh my god! <laughs> that was close. Um I didn't think I was that close. Welcome aboard, Captain. Welcome aboard, Captain. That's all they ever say. Now I needed a piece of titanium and gold, right? If I'm correct. Yep. So let's go in. Uh, in terms of an actual upgrade for the like depth module, what what is our maximum depth? Does it? Okay, we can go 500 meters. That's not bad. Um, but I would at least like to get the first upgrade. I will say that. Uh, I should have grabbed a piece of copper, but I think I'm technically out of copper. There we go. We'll build that one right there. And then we'll put the radio over here on this side. And here. Kind of want to do a little bit of decorating. Um, what was that? That should have just been a reef back. There's nothing around here. What I can do here as well. I'm pretty sure. Can I do this? I might be able to build solar panels on this. But what do I need for solar panels? Maybe it was correct. Okay, no. I might. I need copper, though. Copper is the one thing I'm out of. But what I want to do, we want to grab one of you. One of you. Then I want to grab all my titanium. Then we also want to scroll down here because I also want to unmark the Cyclops because I'm tired of looking at it. There we go. Now, rubies. Do we got we got one ruby. Um, in terms of a plasteel ingot, we're not going to be able to do that. So, let me see if I can mark a ruby on this at all. No, I can't. But what I could do... Because I am going to need it. We'll start getting some metal salvage popping up. And I want to take the Seamoth. Sea moth? Why isn't the Seamoth docked? Welcome aboard, Captain. I didn't want to dock it. Dang it. I'm losing my mind here. Now, this is what I wanted to do. Then we can dock it to the inn. Now our sea moth comes with us. Now, of course, I do want to match the colors to the sea moth. So, let's get boom and then boom. Done. Uh, we got cameras, right? Wonder if I can just see it in the camera. Oh yeah, that—that's what we were looking for. Ooh, ooh, careful, the base is down there. There we go. Um, this also has a modification station, right? Oh no, I can just ac access the upgrades. Um, so it's a dark blue that I did for the second stripe, right? Okay. And... Okay, now let's go look and see how I like this. Ah! 
I mean, I like it. It matches the Seamoth. We can do with this. We can work with this. Okay. Um, now, let's actually... Is that the only thing it's detecting? Damn. Um, what I'd like to do here is we went to an area last time where they had these little, uh, walk... They weren't little, but they had walking creatures. Now... In flank, emergency speed. Warning, vessel kill. Excessive noise. I don't care if it's making excessive noise right now. We shouldn't really have to worry about anything out this way. Um, but we are gonna head... Do I have a compass? Oh, yeah. South. Warning, engine overheat. The head standard. I can overheat the engine? Okay, we gotta be careful on that. I didn't even see where that was. So, we do gotta charge here on this. We gotta be careful. I need to not head south. Right, we need to head south. Southwest. Uh, we're good. Uh, where's my whole integrity? There. It's the whole integrity there. Um, I'm going to be completely honest. I think I've gone into the dunes. <laughs> Better to, like, to control it this way. No, the Degasi base is down that way. So, now let's head this way a bit. I'm just going to use the camera system to make sure I'm not going to hit anything. So, we've been down in here a couple times. This should be the Sparse Reef. the floating island so biodiversity in this region is unusually low cause unknown wait so biodiversity in this region is so wait is there something I don't like being in this in between like at all We're just trying to find the Strider path. It was here to the southwest. Seek fluid intake. How bad is this? How bad is my seek and fluid fluid intake? That should hold us. Um, it's not really the best what we're in. I wanted to go down here and look at these guys again. I just figured that it would be a good trip for us to use the thing for, but I always forget about the water. There's a ruby. I could use that. Um, could also use that. I don't know. Well, what's that? Some sort of vent. Okay. What is... Hold up. No. No. What is that? What is that? Is that the... Alright. Is that the ghost leviathan? That's a ghost leviathan. Okay. So that thing's... Essentially, like a reaper. That is 
Jesus. Where'd he go? I'm gonna cycle back to one of these cameras. We're gonna be directly in front of it. Watch. It's a warper. I just wanna find that strider path. Ooh, we hit something. I think this is their path. I think this is the edge of the map. Seek fluid intake immediately. Okay, okay. There it is. And I think I found my striders too. Oh, I get like a collision indicator. Here, I want to get this guy on the camera. That guy's cute. <laughs> I mean, I bet that thing would hurt. I bet it attacks me 100%. Um, but I don't want to hop out to test it. It's transparent as well. Um, we need to ascend a bit. What was that? That guy's over there. This is just creepy. I ain't gonna lie. Cause like seeing... Oh, what is that? Oh, there they are. Why is this guy so close, though? These are what we were looking for. Striders. think we're good there. Uh, we sometimes hit fish and it scares me. There they are. Okay, I got what I needed from them. We're ascending. <gasps> I might have just died with all my shit down there. Oh, thank God. I just died of thirst. I'm so, I like, forget. <laughs> I freaking forgot about all that. Oh, what did I drop? I shouldn't really have had anything on me. Titanium. But I died in the ship, so I don't think it dropped a thing. Okay. You know what? Now that our water's refreshed, we don't technically gotta go back. I mean, we could just stick around. 
or we could head to a different location. You know what, let's head to the rear end of the Aurora, why not? What's the worst that could happen there? Okay, so I just got real close to where I wanted to be and just realized I don't have my radiation suit with me, so I gotta run and get that real quick. Um, you know what? You are in a place I'm comfortable leaving you. I'm just gonna, t why'd I head that? I'm gonna just take the Seamoth back, get my uh, radiation suit, and then I'll come back. Also, I just wasn't that far. I just didn't want to uh, have to go all the way back with the Cyclops and then proceed. When I could just eject this, run back, and get it. And there is our Cyclops. Go in for the dock. I don't know what that last one was, but I didn't like it. I still feel like we might be in that area where that Reaper was, so... I know we're not, but... That Reaper was way over here still. And we're gonna head that way now. So, like, we have this safe shallows here in between us. Then it should be a red kelp forest. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because there's the entrance, and the Degasi Bay should be right under that entrance. That's an entrance into the mushroom biome, by the way. Um, technically, what I would like to find out this way is, again, a Reaper. I want to take a look at that one. I'm pretty sure we should be safe inside the Cyclops. He shouldn't want to attack it. And we're here. Our boy should be out here somewhere. Ooh, saw something there. Saw another one there. Let's go into Silent, Silent Rotten. I'm still a little scared on this. Ooh, there's one. There's the there's the guy. And it looks like he is like at a patrol path. Wait, is there two of them right there? Okay. Um. Fuck it. It's not. It doesn't look like they can hurt me. Hi, buddy. I think, though, he does want me. He might be able to sense I'm in here. Um, yeah, I think there's two of them as well. I am going to get out of here. Hi, fish. <laughs> so, silent running off. Rig for silent running. We're going to actually re-rig for silent running. I want to go to the front. Um... So, we're approaching the front of the Aurora here, and I just found this. That, I'm pretty sure, is a life pod. Now, are there Reapers around? This is life pod four. Okay, I need both my cameras. I'm actually gonna attempt to leave the ship. Now, what was that? Uh. 
I don't know what that sound was. I wasn't a little scared about it. Um, let's put these down real quick. I brought these along just so that way I could get them out of the base, really. I'm going to be honest. This was just to get these things out of the base. And so let's throw that. I can't throw the entire suit in there? Dang. Um, I think we should be safe from Reapers, honestly. The closest one I see is at the very... The spawn is, like, right there at the corner of the Aurora. So, I think we should be fine to go outside. But, just in case, I do want to... I'm gonna shit my pants. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Oh, I do want to throw at least that in there. Uh, all this in there. My tools can go in there as well. Sea glide, Gun. Let's go check the cameras one more time. <laughs> oh, is it becoming night as well? Calorie intake recommended. Okay, I don't care if you recommend calories. Data. Better. Okay. Yeah, we were perfectly fine. That was completely unnecessary, and I was just panicking and being afraid of a Reaper. So. So, what I think we should do here, let's go listen to that new life, <laughs> that new, uh, life pod message we got. This is from life pod four. To any Altera crew, landed in area of significant alien activity, encountered predators in the Leviathan class, highly aggressive, spectroscope scanner assigned species designator, Reaper. One specimen attempted to swallow the life pod, doing extensive damage in the process. Only viable option is to make for the safety of the Aurora crash site. I have retrieved a data box with the creature decoy and enough resources to fabricate a couple of them. The swim's longer than the decoy lifetime, but it should just be enough to keep them busy. If you don't find me on board the ship, I presume I miscalculated. I don't... Oh, no. That doesn't sound like it was good. So that guy, I think, got eaten. So we got a bunch of the Denasi stuff in here as well. We might have to go through and like actually like listen to this at some point, like fully through. So. Um, but yeah, I didn't think somebody legit died. Well, people have been dying. There's two people that legit died because one of them lit a flare inside the life pod and caused it to blow up. They lit an emergency flare inside of their life pod. And because of that, it blew up. So... What is that? Oh. Those are the rays. Um, but yeah, I think if anything, I'm gonna head back to the base. Um, we should, we might be able to get inside the Aurora at some point. To go do, uh, repair it. So that way we don't have to worry about the radiation. And so that way we can get a prawn suit blueprint. I'll see you. I just got back to the base, and I think I figured out what that other egg was. It's a crab squid. So now, I got my own little crab squid. Emergency. Starvation imminent. Yeah, yeah, I know starvation is imminent. Go eat some damn food.